Hello and welcome back to part 19 of The Witcher 3. Getting ready for our audience with this guy, so let's choose this outfit. Bam, bam, bam. Okay. Now what? This might come as news to the gentleman, but a towel wrapped around one's waist is not fitting attire for an audience. The gentleman will kindly dress. Alright, damn it. Let's dress. Uh, we're a gentleman after a moment. No guardian trousers. And that. And that. There we go. Happy now. <laughs> black suits the gentleman. I like Does black. the outfit satisfy the gentleman? I suppose so. A studded doublet and a sword on my back. That's what would satisfy me. But tough, when in Nilfgaard. Yes? It's a saying. So what now? Powder my nose? <laughs> Probably. No need. The gentleman's complexion is light enough. The gentleman is to stand before the yes, ruler pale. of the north and south. I must confirm that he knows how to bow. I know how to bow. I'm not some boar. I know how to bow. Please, demonstrate. That, sir, is how you might bow to a whore <laughs> on a street corner. Not to the Emperor of Nilfgaard. Please watch. Leg extended. Hand flat. Head down. Chin to chest. The chin gentleman chest. will rehearse. fluidity and grace but we've learned to expect less of Nordlings come with me <laughs> Jeez, this must be really important the gentleman will address the Emperor only when asked to and using the appropriate title your arch magnificency I see the gentleman is in the mood for jests <laughs> I fear the Emperor might not share his disposition your majesty will suffice Spoken loudly, clearly, and with respect. Okay. I'm sure we can trust Geralt to be respectful. And there he is. In Grimmy at Art Cancer. Dyfen Aden in Karn Eb Marvut. Emir Var Emres. Bow. This bow. Your Imperial Majesty. Arer ep do orde. Avelian nomen vat gun favot. All except the Witcher. Get out of here. <laughs> so, what's the point? It's just gonna be a one on one conversation. I thought you bowed before no man. <laughs> Trying to be nice. Didn't want to disappoint the Chamberlain. We're friends. Take it you didn't summon me to reminisce about the good old days, so... Silence. My daughter Cyrilla. She's returned. And she's in danger. Siri. The wild hunt pursues her. You will find her and bring her to me. She's back, you sure? Are you sure? Siri left, went far, far away. Do you believe I'd drag you here in the middle of a war to discuss a rumor? I think anyone can be wrong, Maybe. even an emperor. I had forgotten how insolent you can be. I haven't the time to convince you, nor the desire, in fact. Yennefer will do that. After the audience. Why me? How many men in your army? 20,000? 30? So why me? You know why. Because she trusts you. 
She trusts me, yes. So tell me why you're looking for her. Doubt it's about making up for all those lost years. For reasons of state, as always. Mm. Enough of this banter. You will agree regardless. <laughs> if for no other reason than because I shall pay you. More than you customarily receive for a contract. Considerably more. Uh, doing this for Siri. Save your generosity for those whose homes your armies have raised. I'll do it for Siri, not for your gold. Your motives do not interest me, only results. Yennefer will tell you the rest. This audience is finished. Meredith! Take him to the sorceress. Who knew series deck could be so demanding? Follow me, if the gentleman pleases. Please keep close. There are many honorable guests in the palace whom the gentleman disgusts. Need not bother. Okay. Okay. First thing in the morning, and it's past ah, noon. I found you. What? What's going on here? You're talking to yourself, gentlemen. I'm Herivard the second, Prince of Elanda. Can't run. I've seen us for another grand Can't still use our senses. Rad sliedne e nekt estu. Tete tage in den kalantne se voloisa. Ep tu sa? Mind if I interrupt? Why not join in instead? We're discussing neutrality. How difficult it is to preserve. Hmm, always worth trying. Still worth trying. Because? Because there are few causes worth serving, even fewer men. Mm. Enough about that. Mind if we change the subject? Talk to the Emperor. So, talk to the Emperor. Hmm. Why did he summon you? So not even you know. No. But I wager it's an ordinary witch's contract. Mm -hmm. Somewhat. Some weirbubs. Farewell. See ya. Soon, mind you. Before we do anything, I want to see what Forgive us, save me. We are occupied. You're occupied. Did I okay. not request? Uh, yeah. Will someone explain to me why you are here? What now? I'm here because I was summoned to be. Who are you? How do you dye your hair? Is it a brew of parsley root? It's natural. It comes with being a witcher. Alright. Let's go. Do not bother me. I like to bother you. What's going on over here? They're speaking of garden. We've no need for the gentleman's escort. We've no need for the gentleman's escort. Right, Is the go. gentleman not in a hurry to see the sorceress? No, I'm in the area, all right. Probably gonna get it on. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. Okay. Once the gentleman is done, he should see me to retrieve his possessions. That quill sharpened yet? Yes. Then transcribe. The true authority in Novigrad is not the city council or the merchants' guild, but the Church of the Eternal Fire and the criminal underworld. At times, it is difficult to tell the one from the other. They both display a similar ruthlessness and cynicism that... Please wait, Your Excellency. I'm falling behind. You know what? I'll write the report myself. You'll need only prepare a clean draft. In triplicate. A shame I have no time. Can not talk to him? And this is where Yennefer is. Geralt, that tunic. You look positively smashing. Smashing. <laughs> Dying to take it off. 
I'd consider that a proposition under different circumstances. One I might even take you up on. But we've matters to attend to. Now do you understand why I am at Amir's court? Mm -hmm. And seems we're in the same boat now. Siri, she's really back. No chance he's mistaken. Look, that's more or less what she looks like now. Or so our agents claim. Our little witch has grown into a young lady. She all grown up. How about that? She's grown up. It's been years since you trained together at Kaer Morn. Mm-hmm. It's been a great deal has changed. It's been since the beginning of the game. You haven't. Not a bit. I missed those awkward compliments of yours. <laughs> awkward. But let's focus on Siri, all right? Right. Amir said the wild hunts after her. I'd find that hard to believe before what happened yesterday. How did they track us down? Mm, you because of me. You see, I've spent months searching for Siri, using locating spells, haruspicy, geomancy, anything, really. I knew the Wild Hunt might sense it, perhaps even find me, but I thought I'd tricked them. Well, guess you were wrong. Hmm. I've sensed them on my trail, hunting me, for some time. If not for you and Amir's soldiers, they'd have gotten what they were after. I can't risk another encounter like that. It's time to put away the magic, turn to more traditional methods. To the best tracker I know. Me? You must find her, Geralt. Before the wild hunt does. So where is she? Uh, what do they want from Siri? The wild hunt. What could it want from Siri? I've no clue, Geralt. Might have written them to ask, but I don't have their address. <laughs> I know as much as you do. It must be about her blood, her gift. As for what the hunt wishes to do with that gift, I, I prefer not to think about it really. They want to cut it out from her. So where's Siri been? So where's Siri been seen exactly? In two places, Velen and Novigrad. The trail in Velen is most promising. You should make that your first stop. Ask for a merchant named Hendrik at the inn at the crossroads. One of the Emperor's agents. He should get in touch with you. That's it? No passwords, oh. secret handshakes? None. Sorry to spoil your fun. Your boyhood fantasies about the crafts of the trade. All we have in Novigrad are unconformed reports, rumors. But there you will have the help of our mutual acquaintance. Triss Merigold. Apparently she's got a cozy flat on the main square. Sure she'll be delighted to see me. What about you? What will you do? I shall sail for Skellige. There was a magic explosion there recently, blew half Alrighty, a forest down. Back. I believe this had something to do with Siri. I'll be in care trolled. Join me there once you've learned something. Um Before we part, why didn't you contact me, Elliot? One thing before we go. Why didn't you contact me? Didn't need me? Didn't even want to see me? I'm I didn't needy. want to spoil things. I'd heard you and Triss made a great couple. What? Then, I'd lost my memory. Really? That's your excuse? Yes, it is. Let's drop it, alright? It's not what you think, or it helped me understand how much I love you. I don't wish to hear it. Any of it. Alright. Well, time to get going. Guess this means we need to split up again. Not my preference, but I understand. Clock's ticking. It is indeed. So why don't I teleport you to Vel and get you there at once? Not gonna happen. I'll go on horseback, as soon as I can get changed. Have it your way? Oh, and... You really look quite dashing in black velvet. I know. Think so? You told me. Maybe I can have some of my armor lined with it. <laughs> Good luck, Yen. Same to you. And if you wish to learn what's happened in the world while you and Vesemir roamed the wilderness, Talk to Ambassador Vartra. That's him over there. And Geralt. Hurry up. I know it's wartime, but try not to be out. a hero, all right? Just check those leads and come back to me in one piece. Okay. <laughs>